Bro, all I remember was this. When I took my mask off, my eyes was like immediately like tears constantly rolling. Like, bro, I can feel the mucus and the snot running down my nose, bro. Like, I couldn't even open my eyes. Like, it was just that bad the, of the gas chamber. Like, the smoke and all, bro, that was the most. YouTube, what's good? I'm Eric. Welcome back to the channel. And I'm back with another video. Today, I'm going to talk to y'all basically about how my experience was with the gas chamber in Navy boot camp. <laughs> Let's just say it wasn't what I expected. <laughs> And I will say, before I continue this video, that one of the reasons that I didn't go to the military when I was younger is because I was so afraid of the gas chamber. Call it what you want to call it. I don't care what y'all say. Everybody scared of salt and the gas chamber was one on. So, for me anyway. So, I'm just going to tell y'all my experience. So, starting off right, uh, <clears throat> starting off the day, we have to like go to like this class. And before you get to like the class, you got to march. So like you march from where you stay at, um, in boot camp all the way to like wherever like your next activity was. And this day our activity was like um I wanna say DC or something like that, damage control or something like that. it was something of that nature. Or firefighting. It was firefighting. So we walked way like probably like a good one a mile, a mile and a half, maybe two. I can't give you the exact how long, but we marched over there to the class. So it's like a two or three day class and all of a sudden, they was just like, pay attention, you know, not all of a sudden, but at the beginning of the class, they tell you, make sure you pay attention, take notes, is that in third rule? Um, before we even got to that class, like, they was asking people, like, our RDCs and stuff, like, are we, like, are we gonna be able to get in the gas chamber? And they was like, no, nah, we're not gonna get in the gas chamber, this, that, and the third rule, woo. me, thank God. So I'm like, big boot camp finna be a breeze. So they even asked another RDC. He said the same thing. So I'm like, all right, cool. So we go to the um, fire fighting class or whatever, and we just paying attention from day one went by all good. Day two went by all good. Day three come. Okay, this way it get good at. So day three come, whatever. Um, That was like, okay, now since we're done, it's time to get in the gas chamber. Oh, what? We finna get, we, we finna get in where? We finna go what? Where's the bathroom? Where's the bathroom? Like, I'm not gonna be able to do it. Bro. So, everybody making jokes. I, I'm talking about everybody arms, cause you know everybody call you by your last name. So they're like, arms, stage, you ready, arms? I'm over the man. I'm talking about, I'm 38, how arms cross. I'm like, Time to get in the gas chamber. So, before we got in the gas chamber, they told us, like, they showed us and, like, how to use, like, the mask that the firefighters put on or whatever. So, um, put the mask on. You know, we everybody going around, like, they have a certain amount of masks. And, well, they pass everybody a mask, and then we make sure it's breathable and contain. Make sure we can breathe in the mask. Make sure ain't no air leaking out of the mask or whatever. So, it's all good. So, it's time for us to get in there. Um, 38 hot man shake I'm to my so we all lines up it just so happened I was sitting at the bottom like so it's like a rose and I was sitting like towards the bottom closer to the stage oh we go first okay cool so gets over there and um they told us to um they got us all lined up out there or whatever. And it was like, once you get in, don't go past this line. Um, make sure um, you all are shoulder to shoulder, this, that, and the third. Woo, 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 woo. Bro, by this time, like, <laughs> I'm breathing heavy, like, nervous. I'm talking about anxious. Like, I like, I'm like, I know I'm finna just. Man, I was nervous. Like, I can't... I, words cannot describe how nervous I was getting into that gas chamber. So, 
we get in. They open the door. I remember walking in like the little corner over there. So you got to walk down the hall, walk downstairs. Then you walk in this room. And you walk in this room, you're going to walk one behind the date, like I think like like 10. I think you stand 10 by each other and then you start in a row. So anyway, so we get in there or whatever. The gas wasn't even on. So we get in there or whatever. And our mask is on before we even get in. So when we get in, we stand side by side. And it was like, all right, so this is what we're going to do. You're going to hold your mask up. You're going to say your name, your division, and it was something else we had to say. And then you pull your mask off. And you would do that like the whole row have to do it. And when the last person in your row do it, you get escorted out. It just so happened that I'm towards the front. So I got to wait till I see it again all the way. To Bro, I'm pissed. So when I said the whole row got to get finished, and I'm towards the front. So I'm like, so I'm like, I be. So by this time, my heart is out of my chest. Like by this, like this is my this is my body, my heart way back there. So <clears throat> we took the so they started the gas, whatever. And as they, I don't know what they were doing, but I could just see them like starting the gas up in the room or whatever. And I just remember like I don't know like. I just remember, like, in my head, I just see, like, I can see gas just filling up the room, like, fire. I just see fire and flame. This is my head now. I just, bro, I was panicking, in other words. So, it's time for me. My first row went. Second row went. Now it's me. My row. Third row went. Took the mask off. Took the mask off. But, for some reason, I'm like, this is strange, like, cause like, I don't see like what's really going on. And then to the person in front of me was like laughing. Like he took his mask off and he said we had to say he started laughing. So I'm like, what? Like I can see like through the like the little goggle or whatever, or through the mask. Like I just see him like, <laughs> I'm like, what this man laughing at? Like, and I'm looking at everybody, everybody else serious or whatever. So I'm like, what? So I took my mask off. And believe it or not, y'all, I didn't smell any gas. I didn't smell any gas. So I hurry up, say what I had to say. Went all the way down the room, we get out. So as we're walking out, they were like, make sure you don't rub your eyes. Make sure you don't rub your face. Don't touch your hands. I mean, don't touch your face, you know, because of the oil or whatever. So when the lady got outside, or I think it was a lady. Yeah, when the lady got outside, she was like, sorry, we couldn't give y'all the full gas chamber experience. In my head, I'm like, I ain't want it anyway, love. <laughs> I didn't want to do that anyway. Thank, appreciate it, love, appreciate it. But she was like, sorry, I can't give y'all the full boot camp. I mean, the full gas chamber experience. We just ain't wanting to give like heavy gas or not heavy gas. She was like, she didn't want to put like something to make it stronger. And COVID is still a thing because if COVID had a like, if COVID, if, if it wasn't because of COVID, we got we would have got the real deal. It was basically saying like they didn't want all the germs and stuff like snide and mucus and all that coming out of our nose and hitting the ground and stuff or somebody mistake. You get what I'm saying? The germs, basically. They didn't want the germs getting other people and then that'll cause COVID and the spikes to rise up because COVID was kind of, COVID was a big thing when I was in boot camp. Like it was a big thing. So she basically apologized and she basically said that um even though we didn't get the experience that the other um divisions like probably like two or three weeks from now probably will. I don't know what was the reason. I was happy that I had didn't have to go through that. And um that was basically my COVID experience. In other words, it wasn't bad. I didn't have took the mask off and it was like I was breathing regular air, honestly. And I was I was fine with that. Like I I don't even like gas at the gas station. Like when you take the, I don't like the smell of gasoline. Period. So a gas chamber or my bad the confidence chamber or what they call it, it it was smooth to me. <laughs> my gas chamber experience was smooth sailing. Like I was I was to the team. But uh, yeah, that was my experience, man. If you like this video, want to know any more things, 
they have the men boot camp or if you want to know anything else um any more ideas any questions you know hit me up write me in the comment section below make sure you like comment subscribe share this video and uh i'm going up man i've been posting videos my goal is to get 100 videos for the year and i'm pretty sure that's super duper easy and that's gonna be about it man y'all have a good one i'm out of here peace